boys and girls, Miss Kristen has a different story for us today. We've read the story before. It's called Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Now, today is a little different. Miss Kristen's not going to read you the book. Sometimes you don't have the book at home, and that's okay. You can still think in your brain about the story and think about what happens, okay? Miss Kristen is going to use some pictures to help her think about the story. If you don't have pictures at your house, you could think in your brain. You could draw bears. You could draw Goldilocks. You could draw their house. You could draw some of the things that Miss Kristen's talking about, okay? You don't always have a book, and that's okay, okay? Our story is called Goldilocks and the Three Bears. But remember, I don't have a book today, and that's okay. We're going to use the pictures, okay? In our story, there are characters. This time, the characters are animals that live in a house. This is Papa Bear. Do you remember Papa Bear's voice? He has a great big Papa Bear, Papa Bear voice. Can you do a great big Papa Bear? Good job. That's Papa Bear. He's big. All right. Here's Mama Bear. We practice doing a Mama Bear voice. Here's my Mama Bear voice. Hi, I'm Mama Bear. And there's one more bear. This is Baby Bear. He says, hi, oh, Baby Bear. He is little, small. All right, the three bears live in a house. It's a house made of wood. In the place with a lot of trees. It's called the forest or the woods. Okay? So the three bears live in the woods. Oh, do you remember there's another character? There's a girl in the story. Do you remember her name? Goldilocks. Her hair is yellow or gold. Her name is Goldilocks. She comes to their house and she goes, Nobody answers, but she goes in the house. Hmm. <gasps> Goldilocks finds something yummy at the table. She sees three bowls of porridge. Porridge is kind of like oatmeal, do you remember? There's one, two, three bowls of porridge. Hmm. All right. There's a great big bowl for Papa Bear. There's a medium-sized bowl for Mama Bear. And there's a little tiny bowl for Baby Bear. There's three chairs in the house. Goldie looks in the other room, the living room. There's a great big Papa Bear chair. Gracie wants to say hi today. Okay, go play. <gasps> There's a medium-sized chair for Mama Bear. And there's a tiny little chair for Baby Bear. It's little, it's small. All right, then Goldilocks goes up the stairs. She sees three beds. There's a great big chair for Papa Bear. There's a medium-sized bed for Mama Bear. And there's a teeny tiny bed for Baby Bear. <gasps> then the three bears come home. And <gasps> they say, oh no! Somebody's been eating our porridge. Papa Bear says, Somebody's been eating my porridge. Mama Bear says, Somebody's been eating my porridge. Baby Bear says, Somebody's been eating my porridge.
daddy's been eating my porridge and it's all gone. <laughs> He's very sad. Then the bears look at their chairs. Those are rhyming words. Papa Bear says in his big Papa Bear, Papa Bear voice, Somebody's been sitting in my chair. Mama Bear says, Somebody's been sitting in my chair. And Baby Bear says, Somebody's been sitting in my chair and they broke it. In the picture, it's not broken, so we'll go like this. Boop. We'll pretend like it's broken. It's okay. Then the bears go upstairs. Uh-oh. They check in the bedrooms. Papa Bear goes first. He says, Somebody's been sitting in... Sorry. Somebody's been sleeping in my bed. Mama Bear goes next. She says, Somebody's been sleeping in my bed. Then, Baby Bear looks at the small bed. The little bed. He says, Somebody's been sleeping in my bed. And guess what? <gasps> Do you see who is in his bed? <gasps> There's Goldilocks. Goldilocks opens her eyes. She goes like this. <gasps> she sees the bears. She gets up and she runs and she runs and she runs. All the way through the woods. Remember the woods or the forest, the place with all the trees? She runs and she runs. And then that's the end. Okay, Miss Kristen has something to show you. Look, we used these bears before for lacing. Here's the biggest bear. He's large. This is Papa Bear. Okay, here's my next bear. It's not as big. This one is medium. Okay, Papa Bear's large. Mama Bear's medium. I have one more bear to show you. It's Baby Bear. Baby Bear is the smallest. Baby Bear's little. Okay. Here's our three bears. Large, medium, and small. All right. Now it's your turn to try to retell the story. Okay? Good job. Say bye to Gracie.